walk like this, talk like this, look like this, you could never uh -uh. Bad red bone from the south, riding round, hitting licks with a yellow huh. Bitch so bad when I walk past, nigga sing my name, acapella huh. Hey loves, as you guys can see by the title below I will be doing an unboxing of my Galaxy S10 Plus You guys, I tried to use my SE Well, my S10E and it was just too small for me, you guys. If you haven't seen the unboxing, it will be down in the description box below. I don't know if it's because I'm used to having my Galaxy S9 Plus. And you guys know I do have the um, iPhone 10 um, Max as well. So I'm not sure if I'm just used to having bigger phones. But you guys... I love my S9 Plus. It took me a lot to want to upgrade to a new device. When the Note 9 came out, I was not that excited to get that device. We'll see when the S10 come out if it's something that I want. But you guys, I just love bigger phones. Um, if you guys noticed when I had my iPhones, I never got like the iPhone 7s or the iPhone 8s. I always got the iPhone 6 plus, 7 plus, 8 plus, and of course the Max and things like that. I even went and got the X um, and the XS when it came out, but it was so small. So you guys, I just love bigger phones, um, probably because I'm a bigger girl, <laughs> who knows, but I just love bigger, bigger phones, and I did have the white SE, um, but this time around, I didn't get the white one, as you can see in the title, I got a different color because I just fell in love with the color in the store. Um, this one is like the, I don't know, the purple color. I really, really like this color. Um, and yeah, this phone has done me justice. So if you're someone and you still have the Galaxy S9 Plus and you don't want to upgrade to the newer phone, you know, if you don't want to, I wouldn't just because a new phone come out. You know, I only get phones that I really, really like and I feel like it's worth my money. So to me, the Note 9 is a good phone, but I don't know, I just, I wasn't really that impressed with it. Um, it didn't have really um, a big difference in the cameras and things like that. But you guys, my S9 Plus has been very, very good to me. When I tell you guys, I didn't have not one problem with this phone, not one problem with this phone. No glitching, no getting hot, no slow battery charge, no, the battery runs out quick. None of that. So, if you're someone looking for a more affordable phone, because these phones are definitely on sale right now at T-Mobile, this is definitely a phone that I would definitely invest in getting because this phone is old and it's still working very well, just like all the new phones that has dropped. So, that's that. So now, of course, another bag with T-Mobile. Now, you guys, I will say this. This phone was definitely a little more pricier than the one I had, okay? This one was definitely a little more pricier. Um, this one was over $1,000. Um, so I definitely wanted to choose the color that I really, really liked in the store. Um, I like the white one, but of course, as you guys can see, I did get the blue one. So this is how the box looks. As you guys can see, it is the Samsung Galaxy S10 Plus. I tried the E, you guys. It was just way too small for me. Like I said, if you want to see that unboxing, I will have it linked down below. And I did have the white one, so. This is how it looks on the side, nothing special, nothing on the front, nothing on the side. I did stick with the 128 gigabyte because, like I said, this phone was already over a thousand dollars. Inside, you will get your SIM card. Just like yesterday, you guys, I already um, got them to activate the SIM card in the store. So that's that. Inside of the box, it's pretty much the same thing that was in the box yesterday. Your fast charging device, the connector, which is um, what you will need to transfer over 
your information from one device to the next. So it's gonna be really, really easy for me to just plug that into the device and put my um, information over to the new device, which I absolutely love. And then of course it comes with the um, USB plug you need to charge up your phone and the new headphones. So that is what everything look like that comes in the box. Just in case you guys did not see the unboxing yesterday when I did the Samsung Galaxy SE. And a lot of people was in the comments saying they had the S10 Plus and they loved it. So, of course, I was like, you know, let me just use this phone, check it out, see how I like it. And it was definitely, definitely too small for me. And then there was so many selling factors on this phone when I went back into the store which I'll show you guys looks like in the blue. I did choose the blue because when I went to the store yesterday, when I purchased the E, they only had the white and the black one available. When I saw this blue, I fell in love. They didn't even have this one in the store yesterday. You guys remember when I did the SE unboxing? I told you guys I went to two or three different stores looking for the SE. None of them had the blue. But the store that I went to yesterday did, and I just love how this blue looks. So I'm definitely going to get some clear glitter cases to go on this device so I can definitely be able to see how gorgeous this blue is. And to me, the white on the bigger one looked kind of like holographic or something, and I didn't want the bigger one to look like that. your sim card injector and like you got in the other box the device package screen protector the welcome guide transferring of the devices right here terms and conditions and the warranty now i want to go ahead and open up this because i just want to see if it tells you anything about the camera because it is Two or three cameras on the back. I can't remember. So just showed you the camera, the flash, the camera, and the power lock. So pretty much like everything you got in the SE box and things like that. Of course, you can make your um, AR emoji, just like the iPhone emoji and everything like that. So that's that. I'm going to go ahead and power this boy on and set it up just like I did yesterday. I'm sure it's the same setup, real quick and easy. Let's get started. Let me help you get set up more easily by guiding you through the steps. Let's look at the terms and conditions. Once you read and agree to these, we can really get going. You can restore the settings and contents from your old device. It will Wi-Fi would be quite handy here. Choose a network. Log in to a Samsung account to get the most out of your device. Alright, we're all set. And that is how easy it is to set up your device. Like I said, I am going to go ahead and put my SIM card in here once I'm done. Smart Switch is asking me to go ahead and set that up, which is something I'm going to do as soon as I am done setting up this device. So, of course, nothing is going to work. I do love the cameras in the front and the cameras in the back. I'm actually probably going to start filming with this device to show you guys the difference in just like the quality of this phone 
this camera on this device is supposed to be one of the best cameras out there as far as Android devices. So this is pretty much how it looks. Nothing major. Like I said, I have to go in here and set everything up. As you guys can see right here. So this has pretty much been my unboxing of my new Samsung Galaxy S10. Leave that in the comments. Let me know if you guys have an S10. Let me know. I mean, an S10 Plus. Sorry. Let me know how you guys are liking your phone and things like that. And that's pretty much it for this particular video. I love you guys so, so much. And also, let me know if you guys want to see how I customize my phone and change everything up. A lot of you guys were saying that yesterday you wanted me to start doing my videos. Before I show you guys how I customize my phone, because I didn't say I was going to change this ugly keyboard. And a lot of you guys was like, can you please do the video and show us how you're going to do that and things like that, which is very, very easy. So if you guys want me to start doing those type of videos, customizations and things like that, just let me know and I will definitely do that. You guys know on my iPhone, I have where I can watch free movies and things like that with different apps. If you guys want me to do that with this particular device, let me know and I can do that for you guys, how to watch free movies and things on your Android device. So give this video a thumbs up. You guys want those, spam the request you want with this device down in the comments below. I love you guys so, so much. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram and Snapchat. Snapchat saw this first. And until next time, you guys. Bye. I had to hop off the porch and go get it. I went to pick up the torch and then lit it. They tried to tell me I can't, but I did it. When I pull up, bitches look like they shit it. I had to start from the motherfucking bottom.